Well, how's it going, guys? It's that time of night again. Time to go out and make a little bit of money. It is Wednesday night, December, well, I don't know, what is today, the 8th, the 9th, something like that. I think we're starting to get into that uh, holiday season where people are starting to be a little more generous. I'm hoping so, anyway. They're getting a little lazy, don't want to cook, they want to eat out a little bit, maybe they don't want to go out, but they want to eat out and be a little more generous with their tipping. I know back when, way back in the day, pre-military, pre-internet uh, like this is dial-up internet and everything. When I used to work in uh, restaurants, I used to wait tables and bartend, and this time of year was the best time of year. So let's hope it carries over into this too. Um, we'll see. But I'm headed out to the spot. Let's see if we can make a little money. It is kind of, it's pretty nasty tonight. Like, just kind of a dreary, drizzly. It's not really raining, raining. Probably enough that if I stood outside for five or 10 minutes, I would get a little a little wet, but you don't get wet just walking, you know, walking in and out, but the ground's wet and it just looks nasty. And it's just, I don't know. <laughs> it's not a pleasant looking night, night but maybe, Maybe that'll get more people to order food. Sometimes that's the case. We'll see. I'm going to find out. Do me a favor while we go out there. Give me a like. Thumbs up. Hit it for me. Hit that subscription. Subscribe for me. Ring that notification bell. Leave me a comment. Tell me what you think. Give me some suggestions. Ask me any questions. I'm always open for it all. I'll see you out there. All right, just got the first order. Uh, I think it was $12. I already forgot, 11 something maybe. Anyway, uh, it's for seven miles, but you know, some of that's driving to the restaurant just getting to my spot, so it's no big deal. Uh, it's a Grubhub order, so let me go pick that up and get it started. Okay, I just picked up a DoorDash order and in addition to that, eight and a half miles for, I'm sorry, eight and a half dollars for like 3.3 .3 miles that's on the way. Same general area, so it works out well. Oh man, so going to get my second order, the DoorDash order at Chick-fil-A. I'm headed there, I'm already a little late, just not bad, but it's gonna be a few minutes late because of where it was at and everything. And then I missed my turn. And then I tried to go the second next route and there's a wreck, so it made me go like the third next route. So it's put me like way behind. I gotta hustle to not get a uh, contract violation. I think I'm gonna make it in time to not get one, but Jesus, it shouldn't have been this difficult. It's kind of my own fault, but still. All right, finally getting in here to Chick-fil-A. Took longer than it should have. <laughs> Little my fault and little not my fault. In any, any case, I'm here. Let me go get this food. Got those two done. And uh, no big deal with them. They were like so close to each other. It was crazy, huge coincidence. Couldn't have picked them any closer hardly. They were literally like a block and a half away. So that's nice. I, but the, you know, I got directions, a map, Google Maps for each of them. And they both, and the, each one had me going like different ways. So I was like, oh. so I was like, oh, I'll go to the one that is the closest you know which i'm gonna get there quickest first not knowing that they're right next to each other because it's taking me two different directions and you know and i ended up going and they're like a block and a half from each other so i don't know why it sent me two different directions it's both I keep getting interrupted by doordash orders the first one sucked but this one i ended up picking up anyway long story short with the other took me two different directions with google maps and ended up basically in the same spot so anyway, I just got another order, DoorDash. It's only $7, but it's only 0.7 miles. So I thought, why, why not? Go ahead and grab it. 
it's only six o'clock so it's still early so it's a slow time even though I've actually been getting a few orders so hopefully that's a good sign for the night I'm gonna go run in and grab it Woo! I'm gonna try not to get run over here I look up and it's backing up right at me this place pad thai is so good Right, that house was literally just half a mile away, so that was awesome. Uh, and it did have a $3 hidden tip, thankfully, because, uh, sorry, waiting for that car. It did have, thankfully, it had that three dollar, uh, $3 hidden tip, I can't speak all of a sudden, because I did have to wait like seven, eight minutes to get the order. I got there so quick that uh, I had to wait a little bit for it. But anyway, got it dropped off and I'm headed back to get some more. All right. Got this DoorDash order, $21 and change for nine miles. I'll take that all day. It's mostly freeway miles on top of that. All right, guess just got that one dropped off. A uh, nice tip on there. We, it is $6.56 and I'm at like $52, I think, something like that. And I just got a Grubhub order. It's for $20. Uh, it's for 10 miles, but most of that was the direction I was headed to anyway, so it's going to be way less than 10 miles. So let me go grab that. Uh, so I'm a little annoyed and disappointed, but it's not a huge deal. That order, Grubhub order, turned out to be two. Not just one, it's a stack order. I'm still doing it, but I thought, you know, $20 order for one, still for two is still good. And uh, so one was to 7-Eleven, which I just picked up. And I never take 7-Elevens, but that was super easy. I didn't realize how easy they were. I just went in and grabbed it. And then the next one is for Applebee's, so I'm headed to go get it. So not a huge deal, but just a little bit annoying. run into it this is connected to our mall here my son works in this mall he just got a job here proud of him anyway grab this food hey how you doing Thank you. No problem. Thank you. Appreciate the directions. Got both those dropped off without any issues and immediately got a Uber Eats order and a Grubhub order. Uh, I'm not sure if they're in the same direction or not, but the because I'm not sure where the Uber Eats order is going, to be honest, but it's only like 1.7 miles and the other one's a little over four miles. So with it being clo that close, I think I should be good. Uh, We'll find out <laughs> when we go knock those out. I think I'm at like $73 or something. I'm not sure. It's up here. You saw it. Uh, you know better than I do right now. <laughs> I'm on my way to go get those. All right. Pulling into McDonald's here. This is where my order is from. Hopefully they're fast. I haven't been to this one in a while. So I don't know how fast they are. Hopefully they're as fast as the wind that I usually go to but my last couple of orders brought me over to this other town that I do sometimes it's not as good but it's giving me good orders so I haven't been able to go back I'll probably end up just finishing up over here tonight so anyway we'll see Alright guys, I'm calling it a night. Finishing up a little early. Uh, it's kind of a night that took me in a bunch of different places. You know, it took me all the way to the t to the next town. And then it dang near took me home. I'm just about home. So I'm finishing it like half an hour early. 
but I made about the same as last night where I was like 15 minutes early last night. So 15 minutes earlier than last night, I think I made like $95. I'll put it up there. You'll see it. Put them right there. And uh, yeah, it was a pretty good night. It was an easy night. Did a little bit of driving, but nothing too bad. Uh, really only one order was some driving. It was worth it. It was like $21 for nine miles. And that's what brought me into this other town. And then just kind of around this town. Uh, yeah. It's just not worth it to keep trying right now because I can't get any DoorDash orders anymore in this town. Uh, I had to drive all the way back over because it's out of my DoorDash area. I could get some Uber Eats and Grubhub orders, but they slowed down. And I tried, I, I ended my dash and see if I could start a new dash over here, but it's not busy enough here either. So, you know, I probably wouldn't get anything even if I could have signed on. So $95 for two and a half hours work. Yeah, I'll take it every single time. So anyway, uh, do me a favor, guys. Smash that thumbs up. Give me a subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Turn it to all. Do me that favor. Leave a comment. Tell me what you think. What's going on with you? And uh, I'll see you on the flip side.